Jack Chevney cemented his name into Irish lore during the famous win one for the Gipper game, where he scored the tying touchdown against Army in 1928 and yelled, that's one for the Gipper, as he crossed the goal line. He later served as an assistant coach at Notre Dame under legendary head coach Newt Rockney and earned a law degree. In 1934, he became the head coach at the University of Texas. The highlight of that season was a 7-6 win over his alma mater in South Bend, where he was given an inscribed pen congratulating him for the accomplishment. In 1937, Chevney resigned as the head coach of Texas and was appointed deputy attorney general of the state. He later worked in the oil industry until World War II. In 1943, at the age of 36, he was commissioned as a first lieutenant in the U.S. Marine Corps Reserve, and on February 19, 1945, Jack Chevney was one of 26,000 American casualties at the Battle of Iwo Jima. Remember that pen with the inscription? On September 2, 1945, the pen was discovered in the hands of a Japanese envoy at the surrender aboard the USS Missouri, and it was that pen that was rumored to be used to sign the official Japanese surrender. For Irish 101 on Irish Central, I'm Len Clark.